Welcome to this series of videos demonstrating the features of Open Buildings Energy Simulator. In this video, the layout of the software is explored to give you a feel for the interface. This interface consists of the ribbon bar, the tree view, and the view windows, which you can rearrange as desired. There is also a convenient search option, which helps you to easily find any required tool or function. The ribbon bar is divided into various tabs, each providing an intuitive set of tools. On the Home tab, for example, you can find the main CAD modeling tools, allowing you to trace and edit rooms, add windows, and add doors. On the Roofs tab, all of the roof drawing tools are grouped together. As you can see, these are greyed out, but become active as soon as you create your roof. On the Shading tab, you can find all the tools needed to model the shading from external buildings adjacent to your site. On the Data Managers tab, you can find the tools allowing you to enter the conditions and thermal characteristics of your building. You can easily zone your rooms as required, model your HVAC systems, specify or import weather data, construct materials such as walls and floors, add fins for shading, or manipulate schedules. On the Calculations tab, you can find all the calculations and simulations needed to analyze your building. You can find the dynamic simulations, which use the Energy Plus engine, Daylight analysis, standards adherence calculations such as ASHRAE and PARDEL, steady state calculations such as heat loss, SIBSI gain, summertime and airflow, and reporting for room schedules and data review. Finally, on the View tab, you can find all the options to rearrange your views as desired.